Hello everyone, welcome to the PZ Engineering Channel. Today we are going to simulate the discharging and charging of the battery using MATLAB Simulink software. We are going to discharge and charge of battery in the, using the same model. The same scenario we normally we normal see in the cars, the battery will supply a cold cranking current, which is the current required to start the vehicles in the four seconds and after four seconds the alternators will, alternator will supply the load and will charge the battery at the same time before we start the our simulation please subscribe to the channel like and comment and as well watch the video until the end so that you can understand step by step how to build this model then we can start our simulation. We go to the library. I'm reset reset. Or you can yeah, you can type here to search for a specific components, or you can just come on, you can come here to a common use block. But I'm going my case, I'm going to the recent use use because it's I've been using these components. Yeah, I'll need battery. Is going which is the load mm, power grid bus selector and the idle switch. Yeah. Let's change the load value to one. Is of one is okay. Let's put it as it is resistance. Put our ideal switch here, which we will switch connecting to connect the load and text on off the load. Change our parameters here. We can change to any type of input, need and lead acid. We can change parameters to 12 and yes, 30. It's okay. Let's take as well DC bus, DC voltage, and the step that we should use at the time. Let's take, go to the form two. Let's change the value of our DC voltage source to, to 15 and not 40.5, which is the required voltage to charge. And let's copy our idle switch we use the need. Scope to we need three inputs and uh, layout three down. Okay, Now 
now we need this another switch which will on off the con to connect the rod and the real timer. Here the timer we are using for seconds for seconds initial volt initial value is zero four seconds is the from zero to four seconds is the time that the bit will supply the cranking cord the cold cranking current is the power that the current is used to start the car that means after four seconds it will switch to the alternator Here we just put it right on. Just put on. Dot. Use the loads on. Now we take it to. Yeah, we need the same to the yeah we put off We need the constant which will on off. Yeah, here at the from off to the alternator, off to the alternator, just put one top. When it's one, it means that means there is no action, and when it's zero, it is action for the alternator. And then at the for the load zero, because load will. The bit will start by supplying the load, and one the load is taken off at, at the same time that the that the zero where the load will be on. Let's change our our grid to. Let's create message to five. <laughs> yeah. I think we are ready now to start our simulation. It is saying like the initial is zero and the step time is four seconds. The time that the 
things will start charging the same rate as one motor. Now the battery is charging, or oh no, is discharging, is supplying the car. And now after four seconds, the battery charged. Let's increase just a more better understanding. Basically, what's happening here is the battery will start discharging or will supply a cranking current to start the car or the vehicle during the four seconds. We have four seconds, and then after four seconds, when the car is running, the load is taken off, the alternator is producing more power than. The required car load the, the, the required load load in the car that's why is is supplying the car and the same time is up is charging the battery let's just put a bigger just put it another let's say bigger load and and the, let's decide the car will start the, the battery will start charging after 10 seconds, which is here. So, and then I should increase here the time. Okay, let's make and let, let's see. The battery is charging. Is this no? Is this charging? Is supplying the the current to the vehicle or to a load as we as we know it, we we put for 10 seconds that the, the battery will, will discharge for 10 seconds after 10 seconds you have to start charging which is showing here now the battery is charging the voltage of the, 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 the current that is charging, there is no current voltage, but there is a voltage only that is, is 14.2, which it goes up until the 14.2. Thank you so much for watching. Please don't, don't forget to subscribe to the channel, comment, like the video, suggest some topics that we can work on. Okay, thank you.